Gavilan is challenged by Billy Graham. New York, 29th of August, 1951. That's Gavilan in the white trunk. Gavilan, 145 and a half pounds tonight. Graham, 145. Gavilan was proclaimed the world's welterweight champion three months before when he beat Johnny Bratton of Chicago in a series of elimination bouts after Sugar Ray Robinson resigned the title. Eastern boxing authorities don't recognize Kid Gavilan's claim to the title. They demanded that Gavilan beat Graham before they would recognize the kid as champion. Gavilan says that's okay with him because there isn't going to be any question about his right to the title after he gets through with Graham tonight. The kid's been installed a three to one favorite This is the third meeting between these men. Both their first two fights took place the year before. Both were decided on split decisions. Graham won the first bout, Gavilan took the second. There were no titles at stake in those first two fights, but this rubber match is the one that really counts. In the second and third rounds, Gavilan continues on the aggressive and outpoints Billy Graham. In the fourth, Graham counters with several hard punches and staggers Gavilan. Now we're in round five of this welterweight title bout between Kid Gavilan, the champion, in the white trunks, and Billy Graham here in New York's Madison Square Garden. Neither Gavilan nor Graham is known as a knocker outer. Both hit hard enough to hurt, but they've won most of their fights on decisions. The kid has been in the fight game eight years. He's won 74, only 20 by knockouts. He's lost 12. Two of these losses were to Sugar Ray Robinson when Robinson was the welterweight king. Billy Graham has been fighting for 10 years. He's won 91, only 24 by knockouts. He's lost six. Kid Gavilan is the aggressive type fighter. He comes in, swarms all over you, punching from all directions. His favorite punch is the bolo, a sweeping right uppercut that he brings up almost from the floor. considered one of the classiest boxers in the fight game today. Billy's a great counter puncher, and that's what he's doing mostly so far tonight. There's the end of round five. In the next four rounds, Gavilan's aggressiveness continues to pile up points. Now here we go into round 10 of this 15 round welterweight title bout. A 
About 8,000 fight fans here at Madison Square Garden tonight. Sort of a small crowd for a title match. There's a lot of Cubans and Latin Americans here rooting for Gavilan. And there's a lot of Graham's friends from New York's Greenwich Village. Graham's a very popular boy down there. Graham's fans keep yelling at him to lead more. Billy has been leading a little more in this 10th round. Graham is generally more effective in the infighting than Gavilan. The Cuban kid likes to punch from a distance. He likes plenty of room to swing. When they're in close, it sometimes looks as though Graham has taken a lot of punishment, but he covers up well. He's taking them on his arms and shoulders. From the 10th to the 14th round, Graham takes over. And except for slowing up a bit in the 13th, he outboxes and outpoints Gavilan. Now here we go into the 15th and final round of this welterweight title bout between Cuba's Kid Gavilan, the champion, and the pride of New York's Greenwich Village, Billy Graham, here at Madison Square Garden, New York. Graham in the black trunk. While this bout is billed for the world's welterweight title, some fight authorities insist that whoever wins tonight must beat the Frenchman Charlie Humas the European champion. There's no doubt this last round is going to tell the whole story. Why well, the experts at ringside can't even agree. Comparing their cards, some show even up to now. Others say Billy Graham is slightly ahead. There's a lot of buzzing and conversation among these experts at ringside. This is really a close fight. A knockout would end all doubts about the winner. And the Gavilan fans are yelling for him to give it a gram. The fight's over. It's a split decision. One judge votes for Graham. The other judge and referee vote for Gavilan. The winner is Gavilan. Graham is stunned. He can't believe it. He thought he won. Kit Gavilan, the winner and undisputed brotherweight champion of the world.